Hello, and welcome to Morfolio Trace. In this video, we'll learn about the new project page. We'll learn how to sort, organize, and manage your projects, and a whole lot more. Let's get started. Now we are inside the Morfolio Trace app and in the project page. You can see the main area of the page here is dedicated to your projects. On the left hand side is a sidebar full of a lot of important categories and ways of navigating. And on the top right are all of your tools for creating projects and managing your projects. On the sidebar, you'll see first that there is a sidebar button. If you tap that, that will close the sidebar and open up space for you to manage your projects. If you tap it again, your sidebar will open and you'll see that there's the project tab. There is the recents tab, which opens all of your most recently edited projects. Recently deleted, which we'll talk about in a minute, but has all of the projects that you have deleted. Your settings has all of your subscription info, Apple Pencil settings, project defaults, title block settings, and a whole lot more. The help tab has all of the important help guides for you to get to know Trace. So there's the user guide, which is full of guides on every single feature in the app. There is the how-to videos, which are great resources like this one that you're watching that are available right in the app here. There's help and support to get an FAQ search. There is a request a feature, report a problem buttons. Both of those help you do those things. And then there's community blog, which gives you all the latest news about Morfolio Trace. Now let's look at these buttons on the top right. The first one is super important, and that is how you add projects. So tap that and you can see all of these different ways of creating new Morfolio Trace projects. The next button is your sort button. So if you tap that, there are all different ways to sort your projects. You can choose custom. If you want to move your projects around and have them in a very specific order, you can do that. Just long press and hold any project to move it around and you can drag and drop it. The other ways that you can organize is by name, which allows you to alphabetize your projects kind, date created, and date modified. And with all of these buttons too, if you hit them twice, they'll go in the reverse order. So I'm gonna keep that here. The next way of searching and sorting through your projects is by using the search. So if you tap up here, you can see that you are in the search bar now, your keyboard pops up and you simply tap the any word and that will bring up those projects. So you can see here, I searched Garden House and now all the projects related to Garden House have appeared. One of the great new features in Trace 6.0 is the ability to long press any project or folder and get a quick action menu. This allows you to move a project back so you can move it outside of a folder share the project to export it as an editable portfolio trace file, rename your project, duplicate, or delete it. Now let's look at how to group and organize your projects into folders. On the top right, again, is a button to add folders. Tap that and you can name your folders. So how about we create house one through eight folder. Hit OK, and now you can see that I've created a folder. To get my projects into that folder, all I have to do is press and hold this till it pops up, drag it on top of the folder, and then drop it in. If I wanna add multiple projects to this folder, I can tap Select, select the projects that I want to add, and then press and hold, and you can see now that I have seven projects selected, I can drag those on top of my folder and add them over that way. Another way to move projects into a folder is by grouping them. So if you hit select and then select the projects that you want to group, down at the bottom, there is a group button here. 
tap that and that will prompt you to name your folder. So I'll name this one house nine through 12, hit okay. And now all of those projects have been grouped into this folder. Now let's say that I want to add one of these projects into here, but I don't wanna add it directly. I wanna copy and paste it in. One way of doing that is by copying this project and pasting it over. So again, I can hit select, tap the project that I want to copy, tap copy at the bottom, and now I can hit done again. I can open the folder that I wanna add, tap select and paste, and now you can see that I've copied that folder and pasted it into this one. There is another way to do that as well, which is I could duplicate this project. So I can ha hit select, tap the project I wanna duplicate, and then down at the bottom, hit duplicate. And now you can see that I've duplicated that project. Now, Let's say that I don't actually want that project anymore. I already have it, um, so I want to delete it. Again, I can select the project, tap the project I want to delete, and hit delete. If that was an accident and I actually did want that project after all, I can go to my recently deleted folder and you can see I can hit select again, select the project that I want, and tap recover to restore that project. Now that project will appear back on my main page here and I can simply move it into the place where I want to add it to and bring it back to that main folder. And that's everything you need to know about the Morfolio Trace project page. If you enjoyed this video, we hope that you'll like and subscribe to our channel to get more tutorials as they come out. This means so much to our small team and we really appreciate your support.